with L1 competitors nipping at the heels of Ethereum and the ETH market sentiment taking a beating, should we be concerned about the impact this could have on Matic? So first of all, let's go look at, again, this seems to be a bit of a correlation video. Let's look at ETH and Matic hand in hand. You can see they are very tightly correlated, but sometimes they disjoin from each other. So this is year to date numbers. You can see here, Matic is down about 31%. And Ethereum is only down 2.6%. So obviously, Matic is suffering, which is very perplexing to many. Matic is definitely the best layer two out there as far as we are concerned. Now, let's talk about the elephant in the room. A lot of people were thinking for a long time last year, will ETH 2.0 kill the need for Matic? And no, we don't believe ETH 2.0 is a threat. Matic will still operate much faster, much cheaper, and much better in many cases. And they also are working on a ton of new scaling solutions and they're a leader in zero knowledge and optimistic rollups. So, but the simple answer is if ETH continues to shrink, that will have an impact on Matic. But I think the fact that Matic is there actually helps ETH survive. So it's like a symbiotic relationship. Uh, it's complex. Uh, the performance of Matic has been horrible this year. No doubt about that, but uh, hold tight for now. But you're right, I am... Uh, begin to think of relative upsides and getting very concerned with uh, the whole ETH universe, especially with the recent uh, information we got about the delays of ETH2 and the moving to proof of stake. So that has rattled the markets a bit.